I'm back. Welcome back to my channel. The struggle is real with the makeup nurse. Today is First Impressions Friday with Flower Beauty. Now let's go ahead and get started. So I have this Flower Beauty elixir, supernova elixir, to pour some moisturizer. And I was thinking about like um, starting first impressions, you know, with my skincare, but I really don't want to open um, skincare all the time. And I just want to use mine up um, because skincare doesn't last as long. So, all right. Oh, and today is Fritter's Day, Monday, Special Education Day, Full Fur Day, and Bartender Day. So, thank you to all the bartenders out there. All right, I'm going to use this Too Faced palette, the watermelon palette, that uh, uh, I received from Beauty and More with Renee. So thank you, and I'll have her channel linked down below. And it's supposed to smell like watermelon. I don't really smell it, but look at those colors. And it could just be, you know, that I'm still kind of sick or whatever. Okay. And I know it wasn't the C word, and I know um, what I got, and um, I know that um, I still have somewhat of my, I don't think I lost any of my smell. All right, let's go in with Melon Me, and they have the shades on the palette, which you know I love. So I reached out to Too Faced, you know, just to see if like maybe I could like somehow collab with them in some form, you know. And so when I put like contact us or whatever, um, they said you had to send something on the letter, you know, like everything on the letterhead and you can put your links in, you know, whatever. So I did and I sent it off. I get a response back saying, Oh, thanks for your interest. Go to the career section. I'm like, I don't want a career. I have a job. <laughs> I'm like, whatever. I must have. I thought it was clear because they said I have a channel and blah, blah, blah. And I don't know. So. And then I went to the career section and think maybe there's something you got to go in there and apply. But why wouldn't they have said that in the first place? But then. In the career section, I looked like it was just jobs. But anyway, all right, because I don't have any meetings today, I think I'm going to go um, bold, and I'll go in with this So CD shade right here. Um, I was going to go in with brown and then use that green glitter shade, but you know what? I don't think I'll see hardly anybody today. Just a few people, you know, I'm passing or whatever. I'll be in my office most of the day because I gotta catch up on like a bunch of paperwork and stuff and meetings that um, that'll do next week. Okay, all right, now I'm just gonna go in with that Melon Dollar Baby. Melon Dollar Baby. Look how pretty that is though. Let's use my brush. It's not as buttery as I thought of a formula, so I didn't really 
And I didn't feel like getting up, so I didn't even wear my brush. Let's see how it does without it. So I like to try the bold looks when I'm not going to be like seeing too many like people because in case it doesn't go well. But like my, the people in my department, um, my, my staff and stuff, they're used to it so, you know, I don't really worry about that. All right, I don't think I have any liners, so I'm going to use the Fall Beauty eyeliner. Guys, I'm having a harder time seeing. I have to get my go, go get glasses. All right, I'm gonna use the Fall Beauty primer since I don't have a new primer. <coughs> Guys, today is the last day to be on that prednisone. I'm so happy. It's been not doing, I mean, it's helped my bronchitis and the, um, the, the steroids are not fun to be on. So I'm kind of excited to be off of it. All right, I'm going to use, I'll try this Believe Beauty um, foundation and I'm going to use this um, sponge from Sephora. All right, you know, does it look like, oh, never mind. I don't buy from Sephora um, because I had a really bad experience where they wouldn't even um, wait on me. Um, so I finally left, went to Ulta, and got laid it on. And I was going to buy a whole face of stuff, and this was before I started my channel. And then, and when when I first started like um, trying to learn about makeup and stuff and so I was gonna buy a whole face of makeup and yeah they didn't want to wait on me so I went to Ulta they waited on me and I haven't been to Sephora since so but I didn't buy this that came in my little mystery box but yeah and that's been years all right, now I have the Fall Beauty Concealer. That's the Light Illusion Full Coverage Concealer. That foundation um, seems like it's light coverage, but it um, worked, you know, it was nice. I, did, I like more full coverage, but that's okay, because when I have that kind of foundation, a full coverage concealer works. <laughs> Even though I've always liked full coverage foundations, I have um, 
the less coverage has been growing on me. Maybe it's because now I've got my skin under control a little bit more than from before. When I, a few years ago, man, I really needed a lot covered up. Okay, now I'm going to use the Lower East Side Cream Bronzer. You guys, some of my Fall Beauty stuff in the um, my one bronzer and my highlight um, broke in my um, luggage. So sad. Okay. But you know me. I'll still use it and try to fix it. Should have packaged it up better than I did. So I know better. I know how. I did have it packed in a box, and but I guess not as tight as I. I should have had it more tight. Lesson to me again. No, I've never heard of this brand, but I've gotten a few products now from it. I wonder if it's like an Ipsy Bopsy brand. I don't you know what. I forgot to do that. Not that it really matters. Okay, now I'm going to use the Flower Beauty Crush, Raspberry Crush. Oops. <laughs> I do smell the raspberry though. Guys, I don't know if I really like this sponge. It feels like it dry, dried up faster than you know my other ones and I don't know and it doesn't feel I like my other one better but it's a sponge okay now we're gonna do cream highlight I'm gonna use the St. Lux it says it's a liquid glow so I'm assuming it's a highlight yeah, it's got to be a highlight, not just a body. Oh, look at that. So pretty. Okay, all right, now I'm going to try the Dragon Beauty face powder. Palette. And we're going to go in with this first. Because I think on the package. Okay, let's do this. Set our face with the yellow one. I'm 
Okay, and then let's go in with this one here. It's like a rose. And do the T-zone. Now, I'm not used to doing this color for the powder. So we'll see. They're the same as that normal translucent one. Okay. Okay, last week I forgot to use the actual bronzer in this iconic one, and I used the cream bronzer. So I'm going to use that today for bronzer. contour my nose now Alright you guys, let's blend this, let's blend my face. Okay, now we're going to use this Love Sprung Artist Couture Palette. And, okay, it's almost broken, guys. Okay, anyway, let's um, use the Baby Balloon for blush. Ooh, that's pigmented. To the highlight now we'll just use this one for highlight eternal flame Okay, you guys, I was going to use this side of the palette for the bronzer brush. Oh, well, I'll, I'll save this for next Friday then, maybe. All right, now I'm going to try this Urban Decay Micro Bow pencil.
Okay. That worked out okay. Now let's use the Lower East Side Full Brow Gel. Actually, you know what? I ended up using the soap brows, so I don't know if I want to use the gel. I'll use this next week. Okay. I didn't when I put the soap brows in first. Um, when I first started, I did. I forgot I had a gel. All right. Anyway, let's do liner. Now, last week I used um, the Saint Lux one. I think I used the nude. So. Yeah, I used the nude one. So, let's use the... Wait, what color of lipstick am I using? Oh, hot cherry anyway. Green and hot cherry. Oh, uh, cherry. Okay, is this going to be bold? Oh, wow. Okay. I like these kind of like the gel liners. I don't like pencils. All right, let's try this Fenty Heat Bomb in Hot Sherry. Ooh, that is bright. How's my on again? Oh, it's more of a clear gloss, so. I thought it was going to be bright, which kind of, you know, helps with the liner. Worked out better, better than I thought. Oh, I like that. The, I wish I would have used a less bold liner now. Oh well, I still like it. It would have been better if it smelled. Alright, let's go under our eyes. Take my Flower Beauty brush, blend that, and then let's use the Rise Mascara, Milk Mascara. My lips are tingling, guys. So, it's plump. It must be plumping my lips. But not like a bad tingle. Just enough to be like, hmm, you're tingling. Another coat on. All right, now we're going to go in with Lucy Juicy for my inner corner. For my eye. Yeah, thank you to Beauty and More with Renee. 
for giving me this palette. She does such beautiful looks. And like even even more like creative looks and like for game days and stuff like that. It's so neat. You know what? You have to go see her channel. I'll link it down below. Alright. Um, and then I'm going to take that transition shade and kind of define it a little bit more. Oh, where's my brush? <clears throat> Just to kind of outline and give that a little color. Okay. Okay, last but not least, we have the Makeup Fix Natural Finish Setting Spray fused with aloe vera, and this is Amor, Amoras USA. All right. I don't smell anything, so it's not scented, but it just did feel refreshing. Maybe I do smell something. I don't know. I have to test the smell added when I have a. when I'm not as so sick. Alright, this is the final look using First Impressions Friday. Um, the lip liner is a little too more bold for me, but the gloss was fine. Um, the foundation could have been a little bit more full coverage, but you know, it's fine. Um, this palette I ended up um, as I kind of wondering about those greens but like all green but I think it worked out well thank you very much for that um yeah the cream bronzer was fine um from east side the eyebrows were fine mascara um you know what I should have Put that setting spray on before because the mascara is transferring from the setting spray. Setting spray could have been sent in, uh, but all right. Anyway, <clears throat> for the most part, I liked everything. I don't think I didn't um, like like everything. All right, for the riddle of the day is: It shouts along the streets. Has it any lungs? It tugs and leaves at it tugs at leaves and hurls them at people old and young what is it again it shouts along the street hasn't any lungs it tugs at leaves and hurls them at people old and young what is it have a great day you guys bye